Good morning children. Welcome to Full Standard Children Knowledge Class. I hope all are fine and safe at home. Children, today I am going to do the revision for Smitty Assessment 2. Smitty Assessment 2. And the question paper pattern will be like this children. First name, to choose the correct answer. Four alternatives are given. You must choose which is the right answer. Each man, each question scale me. One mark, five are given. Five into one, five. And the second name, match the following. Five into one, five. Each one, each one carries one mark. Five are given, so five into one, five. And then classify the following. Like given some animal, you must classify into birds, insect and reptiles. Okay, that will carry four marks. And fourth may answer the following. Given six question answers, each question carries one mark. Six into one, six. Totally you have to get paper for 40 marks. Children here classify the following. The sum of animals names are given. We must classify this animal into reptiles, mammals, insects and birds. Okay. Reptile. If reptile means usually reptiles will crawl on the ground. Okay. Some of the example for the reptiles are the cobra, tortoise or and python. Okay. These reptiles they will crawl on the ground. Otherwise they will have the small short legs. Small legs. Okay. This is called as a reptile. Cobra, tortoise, python, the other example for the reptile. And the second is the mammal. Mammal means which give birth to a young bird and also it will feed the baby. Mammals means which give birth to a young bird. Sir. The example for the mammals are the cat, bay, and bat. They will give birth to the young bird and it will feed its babies. And then insect. Insects, usually insects will have six to eight legs and also they will have the wings. Cricket and honeybee. These are the example for the insects. And then birds. Birds, birds will have the hollow bones which help which helps the bird to fly up in the air. Okay. Birds are the example for the birds are the duck, ostrich and kiwi. These are the example for the birds. Animals are being classified into reptile, mammal, insects and birds. Children, this topic is about the medical equipment. Many equipments are used in the medical. Here some of the medical equipments. Cellscope, bathing machine, x-ray machine, thermometer, injection. Okay. These are some of the equipments that are used in hospital. That are used in medical field. Okay. Cellscope. Why cellscopes are used today? Cellscope are used to listen the heartbeat. Is it not children? If you are staying, you will go to the doctor. Doctor will examine with the help of the cellescope. Doctor will examine the heart rate with the help of the cellescope. So, it is used, the scope is used in listening the sound produced by the heart. And next is waving machine. This machine are used to measure the weight. Okay. Waving machine is used to measure the wave. And then X-ray machine. X-ray machine is also one of the equipments used in hospital. If children if you get fracture, your doctor will advise you to take X-ray. Because in that X-ray, we will get the images of the skeleton structure. It is also one of the equipments used in hospital. And then injection. Injection are used to inject medicine in a 
one which is very useful for us. Is it not children? Yes. Alexander the Humber, he discovered telephone. Children, open page number 38. In that you have the two or false. Okay. The heart is an organ of the digestive system. Is it a true or false statement children? Yes, it is a false statement. Heart is not the organ of the digestive system. The function of the heart is to supply the blood to the body. It is not the organ of the digestive system. Eyes are not organs. Is it a true or false? It is a false statement because eyes is also one of the sense organs. It is also one of the organ of the body. So it is a false statement. And then fourth one, the heart cleans blood. It is a true or false statement? It is a false statement because the heart won't clean the blood to the kidneys will clean the blood. Okay, the heart will supply the blood to the body and kidney will clean the blood. So it is a false statement. Brain is protected by the skull. This is true statement. Our brain is very delicate and it is covered by a skull. So it is a true statement. A normal woman body has three lungs. It is a false statement because a normal woman body will have only the two lungs, not a three lungs. So it is a false statement. The skin of a body is an organ. The skin is also one of the organ of our body. It is a sense organ of our body. So it is a true statement. And then a woman cannot survive without a liver. Is it a false or true? Can a woman survive without a liver children? No, it is impossible. So it is a true statement. No man can survive without a liver. Children, the next topic is about the, the woman body. In our body we have different parts. Is it not children? Eyes, ears, leg, hand, different parts of our body. They will do different functions. So here are some of the parts of our body. Like the hearts, kidney, lungs and stomach. Let us know what the parts will do. Heart will pump the blood into the body. The function of the heart is the it will pump the blood. Whereas kidney, it will clean the blood. Heart, it will pump the blood. And kidneys will clean the blood. And then lungs. Lungs helps in respiration. And then stomach. Stomach helps in the digestion of food. Okay, the next topic is about the natural disaster. Lightning. Landslide, flood, tsunami, earthquake, tornado, drought. These are some of the natural disaster. Disaster comes with lot of damage and destruction to life and property. When natural disaster occurs, it will lot of damage to the property and also life. Here children now in the page number the pictures of the natural disaster to identify the children. Natural disaster. Lightning. Lightning. Landslide. Flood. Tsunami. Earthquake. Tornado. Drought. Hurricane. Avengers. These are some of the natural disasters. Children, the next topic is about the Indian languages. In India, we speak different languages. Here, children, here are some of the states and then the languages. Now, let us know which, are, which is the 
the main languages that are spoken in this states okay kerala in kerala the main language spoken by the people is the malayalam in kerala the main language is the malayalam in the tamil nadu it is tamil and then in karnataka kannada kannada is the main language in karnataka and then andhra pradesh telugu punjab punjabi like that in maharashtra marathi is the main language and then gujarat gujarat is the main language odisha oriya assam assamese and then west bengal bengali is the main language children in the page number 47 you have the adventurous sports children adventurous sports is as it is a danger no children so we need a lot of training and skill we need to practice this without practice we cannot perform this games here children you identify this adventurous sports ice skating sky diving para jumping surfing hand gliding and then water ski these are some of the adventurous sports children and in the page number 52 you have famous sports people in the page number 52 you have the pictures of some of the famous sports people you identify okay who is the children virat kohli he is a captain of the indian cricket team and then shrikant kidambi pv sindhu harman preet kaur mary kum harbhajan singh sania nehwal sania mirza and then pt usha children the next topic is that being healthy almonds almonds contains lot of vitamins so it is very important in our diet okay almonds we should eat five almonds a day how many almonds we should eat children we should eat five almonds a day almonds eat five a Banana. It is important for energy. 
almonds okay we should eat five a day and then cabbage cabbage important for our bones and then curd important for our teeth apple apple we should eat one a day banana it is a energy giving food children in the page number 55 we have the topic about the pollution okay the pollution is a process of making the water air and land dirty and unsafe for healthy pollution means making the air water and land dirty that means unsafe for health there are four kinds of pollution what are the four kinds land pollution water pollution air pollution and then noise pollution four types of pollution are the land pollution water pollution air pollution and then noise pollution in this complete the given sentences which should should not do to save the world earth we should do or we should not do okay first i will read out the statement first one we dash leave the tap running when we are brushing the teeth children we should leave the tap running children by brushing the teeth no we must close the tap and we must use the mug because it will save the water okay we shouldn't leave the pot tap running when we are brushing our teeth and then second we dash burn trees we should burn trees or we should not burn trees we should not burn trees it is a valuable resource okay we should not burn the trees third we dash recycle waste paper or bottles and can children we should recycle the things okay we should recycle the waste paper bottles and cans fourth we dash use low energy light bulb we should or we should not we should not use low energy light bulbs and then we dash drop litter in the street we should not drop the litter in the street but also in the classroom children we have the dustbin we should litter the, the paper or something in the dustbin we should keep our surroundings clean we dash turn off lights on the computer when we leave the room when we are leaving when you are leaving the room we must switch off the lights and fans and computer because it saves the electricity electricity is also one of the valuable resource we should not waste it we should save so while leaving the room we should switch off the lights fans and computer seven we dash walk or ride a bicycle to school if it is not so far if your school is near you should go by walk or you can use bicycle okay you should not unnecessary we should not use the motorbike that all okay because it causes the the vehicle that emit the smoke it will causes the air pollution so if your school if you are going if you are going to somewhere it is nearer if it is nearer you go by walk otherwise use bicycle we should walk or ride a bicycle to school if it is not so far next is about doctors we go to doctors when we are ill because doctor will treat us here some of the specialist doctor who treats for a particular diseases for example Treats the diseases related to the heart 
oncologist. Oncologist treats the cancer and tumors. Children, the next is our national symbols. National flag, national board, national flower, national song, national emblem. These are some of the national symbols of our country. Children, in our school also we have logo. We can find this in the school labels, diaries, and then bell. This symbol uh, indicates that this child belongs to the particular school. Like that, this is the symbol that identifies our nation, identifies our country. Okay, the national flag. The national flag is the Tiranga, cry color. At the bottom or the top we have saffron, and the middle white, and then the bottom we have green. This three color flag, right? The Tiranga, cry color flag is the national flag of our India. And the national bird is the peacock. Peacock is our national bird. National flower is the lotus. Where it will grow children? It will grow in the ponds and the lakes. And the national song is the Vande Mataram. National song Vande Mataram. And the national anthem is the Chalagana Mataram. And the national anthem is the Lion Capital of Ashoka. We can find this national emblem in the government documents and it also in the notes. Okay, folded, headed, lion. National emblem, lion capital of Ashoka. Like the and the national game is the hockey. Hockey is the national game of our country. National fruit is the mango. The king of the fruit that is mango. Mango is the national fruit of our country. Thank you.